welcome into Tech Time. You've been backing up your smartphone, your tablet, your camera, all of it to your PC, but now your PC is out of space. So what do you do? Well, you talk to the consultant, Francie Black, to find <laughs> out what you do when you have no space left. And you have a solution. I do have a solution. So just to recap a little bit from last week, we talked about backup. So we're going to take the next step this time. So we had this great solution last week. We expend, extend the space on our phones, right. and then we can copy it to our hard drives on our computers. But what if we also have a tablet that we're backing up and then maybe we have our camera we're backing up our photos to our laptop and our computer runs out of space so what do we do all right so the solution that i have for that is the my passport wireless by western digital and this still gives you all that portability and flexibility and you can still back up to it even without a internet connection and the way that it works is that um, this device actually becomes its own wireless network and you can connect to it from your laptop from your desktop, your tablets, your smartphones, and it can be Windows, it can be Mac OS, it can be Android, and it can be iOS. So it's a very comprehensive solution, and you don't have to be on the internet, but then you access its wireless network and you back up to it. So it's, and capacity-wise, this is huge compared to what we talked about last week. This is like terabytes worth of data versus gigabytes worth of data. So the difference with this and like just an external hard drive is that it's wireless. It's wireless and you can take it with you. It's portable okay. and, um, and it'll feed from all different all formats. Yes, exactly. So let's say we're using this on a mobile device. Um, so on a mobile device, what you do, this sets up as its own wireless network. It's Wi-Fi network. Okay. You would connect to it. And then all you do is you select it from the MyCloud. You'd have to have the app for it, of course, the MyCloud app from Western Digital. Tap My Passport, and then you can back up just by touching your photos, your music, or your video. So very quick and easy. Okay. So very similar on your laptop or your desktop. You would select the Wi-Fi network. It becomes an available drive, much like an external drive. It is an external drive, okay. but you can take it with you on the go. So it's really cool. Um, the other thing that it can do, which is really nice, and this is really popular with videographers and um, photographers, is it also has an SD slot in it. Ah, so if you're out nice. on the field and you're taking a lot of photos and you want to back up instantly, you're running out of space and you want to back up, you don't want to risk losing your data, just pop that in so you can also back up that way as well. So it's very versatile and of course you can do it with USB cable as well. So you've got all those options, lots of storage, you're not so going to run. If you were a tech person, this is like your dream little device to oh. keep all of your stuff in one space. I have tons of videos. That's exactly what I do. Yeah. And that's why I brought this in because it really solves a problem for me <laughs> and I think a lot of other people too. Um, one other last thing that you can do with it is that you can also use it as a media streaming device. So if you had, again, taking up a lot of your space with videos, big videos, and you want to stream those, you can actually use this as a media streamer as well. Okay. So just an FYI on that. How much is this one? Yeah, so that's a great question because this one with two terabytes of data, I think it's, shoot, 150 I believe is the price. Okay. And then on this, 128 gigs is over 200. So you're talking a... Wow, it's <laughs> a lot more storage for a better price. Exactly, but different use because you're not going to take this in your pocket. You're not going to be transferring... Not as convenient. It's not going to be in your pocket with you on the airplane transferring files. You're going to do this, you know, you can still do it offline, but this, you know, this is nice if it's in your pocket. So it's different purposes, different solutions, much more comprehensive. You can also set it to do automatic backups and things like that. Got all those details at iPadWisdom.com, including all the pricing. Okay, great. So you can go there to get it, or you can go to our website, WLOS.com, click on Tech Time, and then we will also link you back to Francie's um, website where you can get her free e-newsletter, too. Thanks so much. Thank you. Zach, over to you.